2020 is here, and there are more anime movies coming out this year, and there are plenty of promising ones. We've made a list of some of the most interesting movies hitting Japanese theaters this year. Before we begin, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest video. So now, let's check this out. Number 1. Made in Abyss of the Deep Soul. The first anime movie is Made in Abyss, released on January 17, 2020. It's one of those anime that adopt a very chibi style animation, which makes them appear childish. But don't be fooled by its appearance, as when its plot starts to unfold, it becomes one of the biggest anime shows out there. There are many anime shows out there that forcefully involve gore, just to be appealing to an adult audience. But Made in Abyss is not at all like that. It makes the use of its disturbing violent scenes to create a perfect dark atmosphere for the storyline. Most fantasy anime try to reveal a bit too much about their universe, just to keep viewers interested. But Made in Abyss does the exact opposite of that, and creates rooms for suspense by only revealing the abyss through the eyes of the character. Since the character of the series are kids, it can be a little hard for some viewers to connect with them. Number 2. Violet Evergarden the Movie In an updated trailer on the Kyoto Animation YouTube channel, the new release date for Violet Avocado the movie was announced for April 24, 2020. The film was delayed due to the arson attack on the animation studio on July 18. The trailer is the same as the last two, which announced the original release date as well as the delay. Kyoto Animation stated in the original post to the Violet Avocado website that the delay was due to various reasons. In a new post to the website, Kyoto Animation has thanked fans for their support and understanding, and that all the staff hope you can enjoy the film with friends when it opens. Violet Evergarden the movie will be helmed by series director Teichi Ishidate, with character designs and chief animation direction being done by Akiko Takase. The spin-off film, Violet F. Garden spin-off, Eternity and Other Memory Doll, is currently in cinemas throughout Japan and will be coming to Australia cinemas in December. Number 3. Fate Stay Night, Heavensville 3, Spring Song The third and final chapter in the series of Fate Stay Night movies has had its release confirmed for 2020. The movie trilogy adapts the heaven-filled truth of the original Fifth Day Night visual novel. The first installment, Presage Flower, was released in 2017. The second, Lost Butterfly, opened in cinemas across Japan on January 12. The special bonus gift for customers buying tickets during the second week of Lost Butterfly's release has also been announced. One of three clear poster files featuring an original illustration. Number 4. Goblin Slayer – Goblin's Crown Goblin Slayer is a series of light novels written by Kumo Kagyu and Noboru Kanatsuki. The novel was published by SB Creative and first appeared in February 2016, until its 7th volume was released last month. Beside anime, this novel was also adapted into a manga series by Gosuke Kurose, which was first published in May 2016. 
Goblin Slayer, Goblin's Crown is a special theatrical episode of the anime adaptation of Kumokagyu's light novel series, and it's set to open in Japan on February 1st, 2020. Number 5. Evangelion 3.0 plus 1.0 the latest news comes from the studio Kara Production Animation Project. Evangelion 3.0 plus 1.0 finally aired on the big screen. This project will be the closing series of Hideaki Anno's rebuild of Evangelion Tetralogy, which has been running since 2007. Not only that, there's information about the inaugural release of the film Evangelion 3.0 plus 1.0, which is in June 2020. Previously, the Kara study stated that voiceover had been carried out since last March. At a Yoko Takahashi X Evangelion stage session at a Japan Expo event held in Paris, France, fans were spoiled with the first 10 minutes of the film. Number 6. Kimetsu no Yaiba Infinity Train A new trailer has been released for Demon Slayer, Kimetsu no Yaiba's upcoming film, which is an adaptation of the manga's Infinity Train arc. The trailer, which you can see shows Tanjiro Kamado, Inosuke Hashibira, and Zenitsu Agatsuma aboard the Infinite Train, which made its debut at the end of Season 1. The trailer then becomes a slightly extended version of the already released teaser prominently featuring Kyojura Rengoku before revealing the film will release in 2020. A more specific date was not given. Created by Koyoharu Kotoge, Demon Slayer Kimetsu no Yaiba has been serialized in weekly Shonen Jump since 2016. With the anime adaptation, Debuting this year in Japan with a two week theatrical screening of the first five episodes. With the anime adaptation, debuting this year in Japan with a two week theatrical screening of the first five episodes. Number 7 Fate Grand Order Sensei Enteku Roiki Kamala Announced through a special panel event at the 2019 Japan event, the first film from the anime film Fate Grand Order, Sensei and Sekuroiki Kamala, entitled Wandering Ekateran, is scheduled to begin playing Japanese cinemas in 2020. Welcoming the announcement, the latest visual from this anime film that features the figure of Betty Bear. Say you who will portray the main character in this anime film has also been announced. Mamoru Miyano will play Billy Bear, while Nobunuga Shimazaki and Ri Takahashi will return to play Ritsuka and Mashu. Number 8. Bishoujo Sensei Sailor Moon Eternal Sailor Moon is coming back in a brand new two-part anime film and now the title has been revealed, Bishoujo Senshi Sailor Moon Eternal. The new film is essentially a sequel to Sailor Moon Crystal, with much of the creative team returning. Original Sailor Moon creator Naoko Takuchi acts as supervisor. Chiaki Khan returns to direct with a script by Kazuyuki Furiyasu. Original Sailor Moon anime character designer Kazuko Tadano is handling the designs. It is said that Bishoujo Senshi's Sailor Moon Eternal will employ a new animation style. And last but not least, Shiropauko Movie. The official website for the brand new Shiropauko Movie, Kekijoban Shiropauko, opened on Tuesday and revealed that the film will open next spring in theaters throughout Japan. The website also confirmed additional staff members and returning cast members, and the front page debuted a new visual by character designer Kanami Sekiguchi, which features the main lead Aoi Miyamori 
and the new character tentatively named Miai. Well, those are upcoming anime movies in 2020. Thank you so much for watching and see you guys on the next video. Bye!